Anders are. When I used to watch Man United, and uh, he was the one who was involved, and I remember he used to do amazing saves, so if I can do as much as him, it would be just amazing. On the pitch, I would say uh, probably David and Sergio. I think they are the ones who helped me the most in the last uh, in the last year, and I think it's the one the year I learned the most. Also, I think the manager, yeah, he showed me a lot of uh, trust, of confidence, and I think he and he helps me a lot every time. I think maybe it's in your head. You think you you're eating healthy, so. And they say pasta is good before a game, so I like to have my pasta with bolognese or mushroom sauce and with a bit of chicken and one salad, that's it. I, I did, yeah, I did. I had to try to see if I was good enough. And when I play with my friends, I, I put myself. But if I play with a good friend that is good at FIFA, then I put David because I need to win the game. For number 10 for sure. <laughs> no, I think I, li I like to play an uh, outfield player, midfield but striker, scoring some goals too. It's nice. Well, when I was on the sideline, just getting ready to, to come on and with all the atmosphere, it's just amazing. And also was Warren Joyce. Warren Joyce was the manager of Wigan. He's the one who saw me coming through. Uh, next to the goalkeepers, so on my right is Sergio, and next to Sergio, we have our, our little corner, the three musketeers. <laughs> <laughs> I remember was, um, I was playing with uh, Switzerland, national team game against Italy, and after the game, well, my agent called me and said uh, I was with some scouts and they, they liked you from different clubs, but the one uh, and, and was united one of them and I, he just told me straight away I think it's, it's the perfect club for you so then I came to United for a week to see how he was as a kid I've, you just dream of it like I said I used to watch United play and you just dream of being there but well, I could never imagine that one day I could play actually for Man United so like you said yeah it's a dream come true Yeah, I think I made big relationships and I think the one who stands the most, I think you know probably, Andreas. We are, we, well, when I first came, we, we, we lived together and we have the same surname too. And uh, yeah, we are, we are like brothers, like we always say. And I think it's the biggest uh, relationship I made. Yeah, oh, it actually, it, it just happened now. I was a kid um, interviewing me and he just asked me, uh, uh, I, I wasn't growing up with your brother Andreas. And I was telling him, well, <laughs> we never grew up together because <laughs> I only met him five, six years ago, you know. Oh, I think I do 10 laps of Old Trafford for sure. <laughs> it happened to me once as a young, uh, as a young lad, I scored a goal and we were actually losing like 4 0. And I scored the 4 1 and I still celebrated the classic one jump. So if I score a, a winning goal, then yeah, probably the 10 laps for sure. I would say two saves the one from uh, Schmeichel, the one on left to the post. Left back by Pierce. David De Gea against the uh, free kick against Mata. That's another good effort! Oh, that's a hell of a save that. That what is a save. hell of a save that. I think it's the first one, the first time I came to United, first week, and uh, I walked in the canteen and I saw Ferguson. I was uh, like in shock and I spoke with him, shake his hand and I obviously I was a 16 year old kid and 
to come to that world was totally different for me. And see Sir Alex Ferguson was, yeah, was an amazing feeling. I like to play basketball. I think basketball. Ah, box. I love to do box. He's good, strong. Ah, he's, he's the top. And I, we met him as well at the training ground. And very humble guy. Very good guy. Yeah. Maybe we should get you in a boxing ring then. And, uh, With him? <laughs> no, I run. <laughs> I sprint. <laughs> no, no, no. Too strong.